slid blindfolds in place, panel? Back yes, on. John. Good. Will you enter, Mystery Challenger, and sign in, please? Once again, panel, back to one question at a time, in turn moving clockwise, and we'll begin things with uh, Pamela Tiffin. Uh, are you in the entertainment world? Uh, yes, there, there has been a time. There, yes, I am in the entertainment uh, world. Um, Mr. Sir? One, one, one. Uh, do you uh, do your principal work in the motion pictures? I would say uh, up to this uh, oh. time... Uh, Pretty evenly divided. Uh, at the moment, uh, I'd say Bennett uh, doing motion pictures. That would be a yes and no answer, but in the immediate context of the moment, yes. Miss Francis? Are you in a picture that is about to open on Broadway? Uh, no, I am not in a motion picture that is uh, about to open on Broadway. That's one down and nine to go, Mr. Cable. Uh, you have also appeared on the stage. Yes, I've appeared on the uh, Broadway stage for several years, as a matter of fact. Miss Tiffin? Uh, uh, did you receive a lot of your training in New York? Uh, in which respect, Miss Tiffin? Well... <laughs> uh, did you go to the uh, Strasbourg School of Acting in New York? <laughs> Didn't everybody? <laughs> oh, at, uh, at one time, I attended uh, classes with Lee Strasberg. Are you married to a famous actor? One at a time, Mr. Sir. Uh, in the course of your performance, do you ever raise that deep, mellifluent voice of yours in song? There has been a time when I have uh, been known to uh, sing. Miss Francis. Worse than John Davis. <laughs> uh, have you uh, done a picture w with uh, my husband? Uh, not that I would uh, recall no. that I uh, did a picture with Mr. Gable, though I am ready to sign contracts immediately. <laughs> <laughs> Turned out at eight to go. <laughs> uh, was your last appearance on the stage in the last year? No, sir, not in the last year. Three down and seven to go, Miss Tiffin. Have you made films with uh, any of us here? Uh, no, but I have met every one of you. Four down and six to go, Mr. Sir. Uh, are you one of what we would call the younger stars as compared, let's say, with Walter Brandon or... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> or Bennett Surf? Yes, or I think we'd have to say yes to that. Yes, yes. Uh, Miss Francis? Now, you're not in a picture that's about to open. Miss Francis, you're going to die. I know. <laughs> I never thought I would fool you. I keep feeling I know your voice, and I'm, I, I can't make it go with any face. Well, we were born. Uh, it's so... Uh, 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 I want to help them so much. <laughs> <laughs> Have you been in the theater with me? Uh... On either side of the football. Uh, no, you have been on the side. I have seen you, and you have seen me. So on either side of the footlights would be yes, but that also answers your main question. Martin? You have a beautiful voice, whoever you are. Well, thank you very much. It uh, comes from years of training. <laughs> <laughs> uh, are you hoping ever to work again? <laughs> I have a motion picture that is out at the moment, and I, I'm working now, yes, sir. Miss Tiffin? Uh, do you do westerns? Uh, uh, no. I may after this show. <laughs> <laughs> That's five down and five to go, Mr. Surf. I think that voice is coming I think Mr. Thank Surf has you. got it. I think you're a young man who uh, knows how to succeed, do you? Mr. Surf, you're <laughs> Thank you That was fun. <laughs>
Bobby, when oh, I first knew you, your open. voice hadn't changed. Oh, no. <laughs> it just mean, about... It isn't going to open. It's opening at Rady's It's place. open. Yes, yes but... opened already. It opened... And it's a big uh, man. You know, yes. it was funny. It's Arlene big, started yes. to say, oh, yes. are you in one that is recently yeah. opened, and then you pulled it back. And yes. your phraseology was such that we could give you a no. Yes. It opened at Radio City Music. Hold on. Without painting the lily, you should be very proud. I have not seen unanimity in the critics like this for a long, long time. Oh, you're mad about it. <laughs> That's the greatest news. Congratulations, Arlene. But he took, gave you a great clue, Arlene. You know, we all tired. Um, from New tired. England, and I... You didn't detect the accent no. at all? No Boston accent? I got a little bit of accent, but I couldn't put your couldn't face on right. it. Right. You've been away so long. thought I was Gene it. Kelly or something. <laughs> your Bobby. speech has been purified by the Strasburg students. That's right. right. <laughs> but yeah. you were born in Newton, right? Right, Newton, right. Massachusetts. Arlene's Brookline. Yes, Brookline, right. Brookline, not too That's right. And I'm right. going to Boston Tuesday. Are you really? That's oh, right. Great. I went up... Uh, well, Arlene knows. I went up, what, three, four weeks ago yeah. to Deaconess Hospital, the Deaconess Hospital dinner. We get up once in a while, and it's, it's I can't a wonderful wait to get going there. home. I love it up there. The only unsettling thing... Is the thing... picture opening up there, Bobby? Yes, it opens Tuesday night in Boston. And you're going to the opening? I'm going to wear a tux and, oh, I'm wear a tux and be an usher. Oh. <laughs> you better look out how you wear your hair, Bobby. You may be right. mistaken for Bobby Kennedy. Well, well, you never know. <laughs> that would be so bad. Should we tell him? Uh, should we tell him, Arlene? As an old Newton boy, you know, most unsettling thing ever happened to me. I went to Tilton School as Bennett is oh. tired of hearing in Tilton, New Hampshire. So I went up and came back down to Boston. This was three or four years ago. And uh, I'm sure that in your younger days, Scully Square. That's right. It doesn't yeah, exist a, anymore. No, I hear that. There's no oh, Scully oh. Square. It's that's the most right. terrible thing. You walk into Scully that's Square. That's where we met. That's Isn't where we that met. Coming again. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> there, was a, there was an old burlesque theater there. Oh, wasn't there? That's, that's where they met. <laughs> <laughs> you we went bump into him. No, he was on the bill. On the bill. That's right. <laughs> no, but actually, I don't know why we should bore people with these. I mean, when I was in, in, in college in Boston, in Boston College, all of the... Uh, uh, the uh, Did you go to Boston College? Yeah. I lived on Hammond Street. Yeah. Right, right up right. right. Frank Leahy right. was coaching. Frank Leahy. We had great when you were there, teams, so. I think it was Newt Rockman. No, Newt Rockman. <laughs> <laughs> Newt Rockman is somewhere else. Zero freshman. <laughs> yeah. Well, it's been a great reunion, and I must say again, Bob, I have never seen such unan unanimity in the critics. Congratulations. Oh, I'm very happy. I'm very happy. As it was on the stage. Thank you. Thank you.